Hi friends, how are you today? Well, today I'm going to make a um, kingfish biryani in a frying pan. It's a quite different method, uh, but it, um, it will turn out really nice. Uh, please give it a go and uh, do let me know how you get on. So hope you enjoy. Maybe yeah, let's go. Today I'm going to make a um, kingfish uh, fried biryani. This is slightly different from the mutton and chicken biryani. Um, it's a different way because it's fish um, they are delicate so I don't want them to break so I'm going to do them slightly different way than that most of you know so for this I need um, kingfish I already cleaned up everything and marinated with um, chili powder um, salt and a um, little bit of lemon juice and a little bit of turmeric so that's been marinating for about 20 minutes now and then other ingredients I need three uh, medium-sized onions, um, coriander leaves, bunch of coriander leaves, and um, some um, ginger, about this size, three or four green chilies, and one whole globe of um, garlic, and mint leaf. With that, I'm gonna use curry powder, um, salt, sea salt, and some turmeric powder, and biryani powder, I'll just show you in a second. I've got to take it out. I'm using this biryani powder, just a little bit. And then of course the white rice, I haven't cooked yet. I'll show you once I cooked it. So I'll be using the oven today to um, fry the um, kingfish. I don't like to pan fry a lot in the house because it might smell a lot when it's oily. So I'm gonna pre-grease um, the pan with a little, little bit of oil, spread it everywhere. So it doesn't stick. Yeah, it's done. And then I'm gonna line them up, the fishes, which is marinated. Using all the all the masala into the fishes. Yeah. And then <clears throat> and I'm gonna drizzle some oil. Put my fingers in there, drizzle some oil. Because I'm not frying it, so I'm putting it in the oven, so I need some oil for that to come out as a fried pieces. Yeah, that's it and it's gonna go into I'm only using about two tablespoons of oil it might look like more but yeah only two tablespoons and then it's going into the oven for about 20 minutes then I will check it after 20 minutes and see how it goes so I'm going to now put it in the oven uh, on a medium heat uh, middle shelf for about 20 minutes So I got this fish out of the um, oven. At, um, it actually took, so, uh, took about 30 minutes, 28 minutes to 30 minutes to cook. So crispy, just like it's fried. So I'm only that one side and start with the cooking. So I put the pan on, on a medium heat. And I'm gonna put some oil to heat up. Two tablespoons. So 
I put some um, fennel seeds, few few fennel seeds, few fennel seeds. Once the oil is heated up, I'm going to add the um, um, onions. The onions, I um, slice them into long pieces, so it's just like this, long strips. And then I've got the um, chili chop, um, sliced, garlic chopped, and the um, ginger chopped into small pieces. So first I'm going to do with the um, onions, so they all go in there. until it's done, half done. Don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends and like and share. So the onion is half cooked. Um, so now I'm going to add the chilies, uh, the garlic, and uh, chopped ginger, they're all going in there. I'm going to give them a really good mix. At this point, I'm going to add mm. the salt. probably about one tablespoon, one and a half. Taste and see. I'm roughly doing them so you will not be tasted. Chili powder. Um, about one, about two tablespoons. all those powders into the onion, turn them in nicely. I'm going to give it about one minute for that to work together in the heat. Mix. 
got color really nice long color all the spices are incorporated really nicely so now i've got the cooked rice here just stand the cooked bottom of the rice i'm going to put it there transfer the rice rice all, all the rice there I've got all the rice here, so I'm going to give it a mix. See the white rice changing into really nice color. And that's all the nice spices. Really, really good mix for about one minute so that all the rices get coated. So I have taken bones out of these fishes and uh, break them into pieces. So now I'm gonna put them on top. Yeah, fish biryani is done. Here we are, this is my um, kingfish uh, pan fried biryani. Um, so I hope you enjoy my recipe and um, trust me, it will taste nice. So please do try it um, and leave a comment. And don't forget to share my video so that it will reach other people so that other people can see and um, they also enjoy making it. And um, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.